Well, hello there. Peak Geek here. How you doing, gamers? Welcome to Video Gamers Oasis Play Theater. Um, we're going to continue on our adventures with Puzzle Quest Challenge of the Warlords another day. I want to tell you um, some new developments. Pardon me while I munch on my Maynards. Hmm, that's good stuff. Just letting you know what's going on. Um, a friend of mine at work uh, complimented me on my website. Uh, and also my gaming uh, channel, Video Gamers of Oasis Play Theater on YouTube. But he gave me some good advice here. He told me to branch out with some new video games so I don't get stale. Some of the people may not always like Puzzle Quest. But I've listened to the advice and um, I decided it would be best that I take a break from the Puzzle Quest for a while and do some other gaming videos. I will be continuing on some uh, more Diablo gaming, original. And of course, Minecraft, it's been close to my heart. Um, so PewDiePie, if you're watching, would appreciate your support because you're an inspiration to me. So let's continue on our, um, our gaming. If you haven't already, please like this video. At your favorites, leave comments below. Share with your friends on Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, all the usual Instagram stuff, all that social media stuff. And uh, like my Facebook and Twitter, click the links below. And don't forget to click the subscribe button and click the notification bell as well. So we're going to continue our gaming videos on Video Gamers of Oasis play, play Theater, but with some new videos, new gaming vi games to play. So we're going to start off some mi Minecraft. I have the Lithos, um, the Lithos, uh, um, what do you call, texture. So that being said, cart it's the Lithos texture pack, HD. And I have a medieval um, character called Captain Kool-Aid Man. It's number seven. So let's continue. We already started a building. Um, what I will be doing is cultivating my character, cultivating my, uh, my area, and uh, building it up, cultivating my character so I can go on, on adventures. In the meantime, I'm going to focus on one area at a time. So I'm in I'm in creative mode, just so you know. So I'm just going to uh, first. I'm going to stand here. Where is my Where's the bed I can sleep in? Let's close that. All right, gonna find a bed to go to bed. Betty buys for Captain Kool Aid Man. All right, close that door, and we're going to sleep. So we'll go to sleep, and I'm going to leave the room. There's a cat running around. Just so you know, uh, here's my character. He is Captain Kool-Aid Man number seven. He is a knight, a brave, courageous knight. And we're going to go on some adventures together. Now, we have sort of like a Lat Latino, Latin American... Uh, community here just to be more inclusive on YouTube I know YouTube it's it's very important that YouTube have more diversity in gaming so I have like a Latin American uh, community Latin American village just so to show you that, that I'm not racist that I am very much open to other cultures and other races and other philosophies so we have if you look above here we have a land here we have the area now what I have been doing offline just so you know is I have been building a moat all around this land area and I'm building a castle a castle or fort around the village the entire village and it's gonna be a very large village when I build when I finish with it now you probably I know what you're thinking why why Jeremy why would you want to build a moat why would you want to build a wall all around a, a Latino Latino American village well I'll tell you why there's um, some dangerous bandits nearby there they don't see me they're kind of i'm kind of invisible to them so they're not going to attack me i'm in creative mode they have their the village right here and i wonder if it got flooded oh they're just they're just in the water um so yeah i like this I, so these guys are so like pirates and they have crossbows uh i don't want them to attack my my precious village so i've created a moat of water all around now it's obviously not done yet, but it's making progress. It's making progress. So 
Um, I'm, go I'm going to protect my village from these villainous rogues. So what I'm doing is I'm just gradually building and building and building uh, my village. So what I'm doing here, we're, we're kind of uh, going to focus on this village here. Now, as you can see, I've, I've blown up some, some moat area here. So, um, you know, PewDiePie is really good at, at raiding these raiders. He is a super duper um, white hot fiery warrior. But my, my, I'm more of a, um, a, more of a uh, tactic tactician myself. I'm not so much of a warrior at this point in the game. I'm going to gradually build up my empire in this area and other empires. I'm going to find other villages and do the same thing, build castles all around them. And I will rule over them all. I'll be the one ring that rule them all. And uh, so I'm not going to battle these these pirates just yet. I'm not fit 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 to do that. What's that? What's that over there? I wonder. Looks like some kind of sailboat or something. It's probably something else. It's probably their it's a, some tent supplies. So, anyways, enough chit chatter. Let's get on with the building, shall we? So we're just going to, what I want to do for now, I'm not going to do any moat because that's kind of monotonous and not, not very fun to watch. But I'll, I'll blow up the moat some more uh, offline. But in the meantime, I'm going to build my castle wall all around this empire of mine that I'm building. And we're really making progress. I blew up, I did some blowing, uh, excavating offline. So sorry about that, gamers. So let's continue on with these, this building a wall. We're building a really nice wall, though—a very nice sandstone wall to 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 protect our Latino um, uh, community. I am the the protector, and I'm going to protect this 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 these these, these innocent villagers from these uh, violent raiders. I'm eventually going to create some booby traps so they can't, in case they do try to transverse, try to attack the wall, they will be. They will be, they will be, uh, they will be annihilated by my by, my booby traps. But we're not going to worry about that right now. They're not attacking right now, and they can't attack right now because there's a big moat around them, around our castle. So we're just going to continue building and building and building until we uh, eventually create a humongous, uh, d deliciously, beautifully, and bountiful empire around this community. So we're just going to continue building and building. But you know what? I'm just going to finish this wall and then I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm not going to continue building this part. It is kind of tedious, but I'm going to build the top part first so you'll have, to understand, you'll have an understanding of what I'm trying to do here. I'm building a sort of a, um, what do they call it? The wall rampart. Oh, the, 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 um, what's that medieval terminology they use? For to discuss a castle parapet or castle walkway. So, okay, we're gonna do that. Now we're gonna, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go all the way around here, all the way around this part, and I'm going to intersect this part here. So let's just try to, just do this. Let's just do this. Build this part. And we're gonna have an intersection of castle walls. So it's gonna be like an, uh, an angle. As long as you have the curves, baby, I got the angles. That was a quotation from the Wolfman. Wolfman Jack. The old DJ before your time, kids. Alright. Let's get on with it already. Let's do this. We'll get that, that part. Now what we're going to do is just going to make a little entrance there so that uh, people who are guards guarding the place can walk around. And we're just going to walk here. We're going to keep fighting, building here. Da 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 da. Keep like that. Like that. And like this. And we're just going to keep on, yeah, I don't need that pop-up, but anyway, a little pop-up screen. All right, let's move it on here. That's good. 
So we're gonna go all the way down here. See if we can reach that. I did build a, another line there, their wall there. Now PewDiePie is probably laughing and laughing at me. Ah, oh, he's so goofy. He's so slow. He doesn't know how to play Minecraft like I do. Well, you're probably right, PewDiePie. You, I, you, you play PewDiePie. You play Minecraft probably every minute of the day. Probably don't have time to make love to the to the lady. But anyway, I'm not going to get into that. But you probably you know spend every single day playing Minecraft. Of course, you're gonna you're gonna build around circles around me. I'm I'm also a working guy. I'm also building a website called VideoGamersOasis.com that I have been building for many years and f finally making some headway with it. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna obviously be as proficient as a builder and conqueror as you are, Pootie Pie. But I am doing the best I can with what I have with my resources. My dream, my hope, is to eventually do this for a living, to work from home, internet marketing, and playing games, and videos. I do not want to be, you know, in the rat race for the rest of my life. So I'm just, you know, doing the best I can with what I got. So thank you for your patience, everybody. Thank you for your patience as I slowly work on manifesting my dream life. So we're just going to continue on building some walls, building some parapets, building, building, building. And it's coming along already. So obviously the walls aren't totally built, but the, the walkways are. And we're just going to continue building all around and be able to night build a nice castle fort to protect our villagers our nice tropical villagers excuse me for a moment i had to get rid of that notification it was annoying me it was distracting me too i was preventing me from getting getting my thing done so Con continuing on I actually find this quite relaxing uh, building castles especially if it's repetitious that's why Minecraft to me is a is ideally a great relaxational video game even more though than puzzle quests or puzzle games or Tetris because it does it's not doesn't have I mean it can be stressful if you want it to be if you want some of action some enemies to attack you but really uh, there's a, there's not a lot of terrifying moments except when you are you know if your dog's underwater and you're trying to rescue your dog from an underwater cave and there's zombies and there's like a, a sheep stuck in water and you can't get the dark black sheep out of the water of course that's going to be tense but in normal states it's really a very relaxing video game and I, I'll go even to say further uh, without getting too um, religious that I, I, I call Minecraft a Zen video game it's like Zen Buddhism, it, you kind of go into almost like a state of of peace, of inner nirvana when you play this game because you kind of go into a, a mode of, um, I am one with the brick, I am one with the universe of Minecraft, um, I am one with the game, um. And I'm not going to bore you with the, that, that mantra, but, but, you know, I just feel so relaxed when I'm playing Minecraft. I just feel so at peace when I'm playing Minecraft, even more than playing puzzle games uh, or even playing Fortnite. I just feel so much relaxation when I'm building my castles, building my empire that's going to conquer the entire world of Minecraft, my... I, have, I believe it's called Video, Video Gamers Oasis Play, uh, Video Gamers Oasis uh, VGO um, Wonderland or Video, VGO, I don't know. I, leave your comments below. Should I call it VGO Wonderland or VGO uh, Magic Kingdom? Sounds a little bit Disney-ish. I don't want Disney to sue me. So probably going to call it something a little bit more generic, like Wonderland, VGO Wonderland. Now, it's n nighttime, but there's no creatures going to attack me. So really. Well, hello there. You you watched the video to the very end. Thank you so much. As a token of my appreciation, I recently uh, joined ExpressVPN because internet security is very important to me, being a gamer 
and internet marketer. Make a lot of videos, so I want to protect myself when I'm online. Express VPN. Just want to let you know, for every friend who signs up, we will both get 30 days free with Express VPN. Click the link below.